What's up, YouTube? This is T. Bennett Sexy coming at you with my first review of TNA Sacrifice. Um, decent pay-per-view. Had some ups and its downs. Uh, opening match was uh, Ink Ink, which is the team of Shannon Moore and Jesse Neal versus uh, the team of La Mexican America, I think it is, of Hernandez and Anarchia. That match kind of ticked me off because there was a lot of interference by Serena and Rosita. And they ended up costing and getting the match. Which ended up making, because Shannon Moore was, and Jesse Neal were going to double up and do the Morgasm off the top ropes. And in comes Rosita, messes up the match, border some sort of move by uh, Hernandez on Jesse Neal and gets the pin. The next match, I'm not sure. I might not remember all the match. I watched it last night, so it's iffy. Um, I'm just not going to go in order. Uh, next match I remember is Kazarian versus uh, Max Buck for the X Division Championship. And uh, kind of a... My idea is best match of the night. It was most interesting. It kept you guessing. Um... My favorite part was uh, Max Buck goes to top rope, does 450 splash off the top. Uh, Kazarian kicks out and then tosses him over the top rope. He uh, m tosses Max, Bu Mac Max Buck over the top rope, and uh, then he runs at him. Max Buck does a shoulder block, and then. He's stuck, he gets hurt, he hits his head on so his arm or something, and he's stuck there. And, uh, Kazarian runs back to the back, to the rope, jumps over top of the top rope, and does a sunset flip on the outside, and flips him down and smashes his head into the concrete. Eventually, uh, Kazarian hits the, uh, magic wizard or something like that to get the win. Uh, then there was the, uh, Knockouts Championship match. Decent match, kind of boring in my eyes. Uh, after a while, Tara come. uh, they walk down. Tara walks down after being told to stay back by Masson Rain. Masson flips out at Tara, screams at her, and then at the end of the match, Tara comes up at Masson, goes under the ring, picks up the loaded glove, which we haven't seen in about a few months. Uh, going to punch Mickey, Tara stops her, rips the glove off, jumps into the ring. Uh, everyone thought she was going to, uh, punch Mickey because she thought she owed, uh, Mass and Rain. And she turns and punches Mass and Rain in the side of the head and knocks her out cold. Mickey James gets a pin and Tara is free and Mickey James retains. Another match, Kurt Angle and China versus the Jarrett's. Good match in my eyes. Uh, really, actually, good match. Decent. Not a lot of highlights for that match, but uh, China ends up pinning. Ends up making the best. The only really good part of that match was a. Uh, Double ankle lock. Kurt had it on Jeff, and China had it on Karen, and Karen taps, and they win. And Jeff, and Jeff, and Karen lose, and Kurt and China win. Then you had the uh, tag team champions between Chris Harris, uh, Matt Hardy, were uh, challenging the tag team champions from um, Beer Money. Decent match. Not very good. Uh, Chris Harris kept avoiding his former America's Most Wanted, AWM. Yeah, that's what it was. Uh, tag team partner. He finally ended up getting his butt kicked, and they hit. And uh, Beer Money ends up hitting the AWM former finishing maneuver. And wins the match. And then you had the TNA TNA championship match. 
Um, it's been a while since I watched it, so I don't remember a lot of details. I remember they went out of the ring and they went up onto the uh, platform beside it and ended up. They were fighting in the crowd, and then the main thing I remember there is. Uh, RVD does a drop kick on Sting, and they both get hurt from hitting the mat, or from hitting the ground, and then uh, RVD ends up doing a crossbody from the staircase to the bottom of the staircase, and just crossbody on Sting, but then RVD goes for the 5-star frog splash, misses, and out of nowhere Sting puts down the scorpion death drop, and wins the match. So, decent pay-per-view, uh... Really a lot of information. I'm looking forward to uh, to in, Impact Wrestling this weekend because wrestling matters. Because um, I'm looking forward to hearing Karen's reaction and finding out all the stuff with Immortal and what's going on there. Uh, Raw tonight is, I hope it's going to be good. I may put up a little something about that, but I'm not positive yet. So, overall, sacrifice, good pay-per-view. If you're looking to watch a good match, if you can order only one, I watched it for free. I had a app on my iPod that let me watch it for free. They do streams, but it's crappy viewing. But I ended up getting to see it for free. So, it was really good. Uh, so, I'm happy, uh, but order, the only match that you should really order from that pay-per-view would have to be the, uh, X-Division between Kazarian and Max Buck, because that was a really good match. So, this t Bat Sexy, say goodbye, peace out, I'll be back next Monday with, uh, WWE Over the Limit. Peace.